Sup, your buckets? I'm Minipa. Let's talk time travel. What is time travel? In older Animal Crossing games, time traveling refers to changing the game time or the system time that will allow you to reopen shops, participate in events that happened out of your current time, or even just catch seasonal bugs and fish when you're not supposed to. This is not to be confused with save scumming, which is to reload an older save in order to duplicate items. Regardless, time traveling is as easy as colorful buttons if you have an AC switch, which I don't. <laughs> First, some history. Over 6,000 years ago, people couldn't really cross their rivers with animals, so they built a city in Mesopotamia named Uruk. In the ancient language, this roughly translates to the crossing of animals. Not long after, the ancient switch was invented. But wait, people had to work all day to plant wheat just so they can keep their civilization thriving. So when they were playing at home, it will be too late and shops were all closed. And that's reason one, potential loss of special customers. Now I tried looking for the specific demographics of Animal Crossing players and I couldn't find it, unfortunately, I'm, I'm stupid. While there are no guarantees, people generally have a full-time job. I'm pretty active in the New Horizons Discord and actually a lot of people are taking time off on March 20th just to play this game. Obviously, everybody has their priorities in order. Of course, people can just not go to work. People that work long hours from morning to night, which is actually pretty common for places like Japan, they won't be home until the shops were all closed and all the villagers are in their house. I mean, you could break in. Assuming that you can change the hours of the shop by implementing, let's say, night owl ordinances from the New League game, then the people that just want to relax after work, they'll be restricted in their gameplay and then they wouldn't really be able to play the same way many other people can play until the weekend or day off. Not only that, if some events only happen in the morning or even fishes that can only be caught between 9 a.m. and 4, even normal people that work from 9 to 5 wouldn't be able to catch these fishes. Time traveling will allow these people to go back in time and replay those events they missed and catch the fish that they couldn't have otherwise. Not everybody can be a jobless no life like me. But wait! What if people wanted to fill the museum? If you got shit to do and the season ends before you were able to catch all the seasonal fish, then you're just gonna have to wait six months for your friend in the other hemisphere before you can catch the same thing again. Because you got unlucky and all you caught was a sea base. This is why we need time traveling. Have you ever heard of the term cloud saves? For the Switch, games have a feature that allows you to back up the save data on the cloud storage, ergo cloud saves. This, however, is disabled for Almond Crossing New Horizons to prevent save scumming. This is a pretty common piece of logic. Saves on backup, there's no cloud storage, that means you can't change the system time at all. Wrong. The amount of brain power necessary to come to this conclusion, conclusion is actually pretty impressive. Really? Nope, this is 100% zero IQ. Nintendo disabled cloud saves to pre prevent people from cheating or duplicating items that will otherwise upset players. This way, you can just trade, load a cloud save, go back in time where you still had the item and effectively duplicate it. Now, while that is a form of time traveling, that's not the form of time traveling I'm actually want to talk about. This does not mean real time traveling is not in the game. This is a false conclusion that needs to be shoved up a ghost rectum immediately. Anyways, why do I think time traveling is an Animal Crossing despite all that? Nintendo's already confirmed that Animal Crossing will get free updates for holiday events. Now, why would they bother releasing holiday events as free updates other than hard coding it into the original game like previous games? Because of time traveling. In old games, time travelers could wake up during Christmas whenever they want and go get all the Santa shit before any of the other players. If Nintendo disabled time traveling, period, then there will be no reason to actually go out of their way to accomplish this with free updates. Why bother doing free updates when they could just hard code in the game? Because there's time travel. FUCKING EPITOME! Now, let us move on to offline play. Yep, Animal Crossing has offline play. Which means if you were to disable the sync to internet clock, you will still be able to play the game. Now, wait, but what if you need internet to receive updates or for an update checker? Even with Pokemon, you're still able to time travel by resetting vendors, by resetting raids, it all still exists. Time traveling exists in Pokemon, even if you need internet to actually play. But you don't need internet to keep playing. And that's why time traveling will not be removed. Because if they did, There'll need, there'll need to be some way to force the Switch to only use the internet time. And if you play offline or have internet disabled, then there's no way. Just the fact that you can play offline 
means that you can change the game time, at least to replay old events, to open shops, and to catch seasonal bugs and fish, which is really all you need. I'm an impatient little shit and I want to catch all the fish, and I don't want to wait six months, so it's good for me. That's also why I think, but it's definitely not biased, I promise. If you time travel to dupe turnips, I'm gonna be in your closet. This is why time traveling will not be removed. Normally, I'm talking straight out of my ass, as you can probably see from my old videos, but this time, it's backed by logical conclusions based off speculative assumptions and, of course, facts. So don't worry, my fellow time travelers, it won't be removed. He's climbing in your windows, he's snatching your people up, trying to rape them, so y'all need to hide your kids, hide your wife, hide your kids, hide your wife.